That's hard for codependence because when you get flooded, you go into your emotional flashback and it's competition. In order to hold apathy, you need to upgrade and do uh, alongside parallel sympathy. <laughs> side by side empathy. Which is hard to teach. You know, that's like holding space for people. Then you're calming them and you. You're going into the feeling, empathy, into feeling. And when you go into feeling, you're trying to evoke motion. So you're trying to stir things up and increase emotion. Where if you're in a group and you want people to be safe through rules, you're actually trying to stifle emotion. You're trying to make rules to squash expression. If you make rules to squash expression, you're controlling safety through dominance and authority top down, which is continuing codependence. So it's not a safe enough group. It's actually a safely dead group if you have too many rules that block authentic expression because motion emotions need to evoke motion but one person getting emotional triggers other people getting emotional and then people get triggered and fight each other and then it's a mess yes <laughs> that's why you have to also stay calm and centered someone needs to hold the space and the container <laughs> 